Every year, from July to October, about two million wildebeests, zebras, and antelopes hybrid organize themselves into groups and start migrating from Tanzania's Serengeti National Park, thousands of kilometers away, to the greener pastures of the Masai Mara National Reserve in Kenya. They have to cross the Mara River, which is infested by crocodiles. This is one of the highlights as the animals struggle to cross the river alive. In the Masai Mara Plains, they will be hunted, stalked and run down by larger carnivores. The Masai Mara has one of the largest lion population in the world. This spectacular event, however, begins in January through to February, where the wildebeests give birth in a synchronized pattern. During this period, about 300 to 400,000 calves are born within two to three weeks of one another. The annual period of bathing provides a feast for predators. Driving across the plains, one can literally count hundreds of hyenas and dozens of lions hovering about. It may seem that the wildebeests are doing the predators a favor by giving birth all at the same time, but the predators have a limited impact on the population of newborn calves. Any calves born outside the peak time are far more likely to perish. There is no better time to visit the Mara than during the Great Migration. The sound of the approaching herd is a deep, primal rumbling of thundering hooves and low grunts. The sight of the wildebeest is staggering, a continuous charging mass that stretches from one horizon to the other. This endless grey river of life is mottled with black and white as zebras join in the march. Trevor Ombija, CCTV.